by the testimony of if God is for you, who can be against you? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, welcome to another episode of uh, 3D Boxing Podcast. We are back with quick hits. Um, we're going to get into um, Bam Rodriguez versus Sonny Edwards is going to happen. It's going to happen. Um, I'm going to get into it. I'm going to tell you why Bam should not go over to the UK no matter what. Uh, before we do, please like, share, and subscribe. Follow 3D Boxing, 3D Boxing Blog um, on all forms of social media. Quick Hits comes at you every day, 8 to 10 minutes a day. Keep you up to date on the latest, greatest boxing news and rumors. Uh, please also subscribe to the other channel, Texas Boxing Scene, on YouTube. Plenty of interviews with Bam Rodriguez on that. Um, all right, let's get in. And all proceeds from that channel go to Autism Research and Recovery. All right, let's get into uh, today's show. Um, Bam Rodriguez versus Sonny Edwards is going to happen. I, I got to speak to Bam. Bam said that Sonny Edwards fights next. Um, he wants to fight. Sonny wants to fight. Eddie Hearn said it could be done this week, probably next week, but it's going to be done in, in either this week or next week. The fight's going to happen. Um, you know, Bam's still overcoming the uh, – he's still recovering from the, the broken jaw that he suffered in his last fight when he won the WO belt, um, but it's going to happen. M- my guess is late in the year, probably early December is my guess. Um, and it looks like it's going to be in, in the U.S. Um, that's not official. Don't quote me on that. That's what I heard from the latest report. And, and Bam Rodriguez should, under no circumstance, go over to the U.K. They are all on the Sonny Edwards train now. Sonny Edwards is their guy. Uh, Eddie said that if Sonny wins, he's the best pound-for-pound pound fighter um, in the U.K., um, which, look, first off, Sonny Edwards is not going to beat Bam Rodriguez. That's ridiculous and absurd. Like, there's just no way. Eddie Hearn doesn't understand this. He truly doesn't get it. He's not going to be able to run from Bam Rodriguez, who's a better athlete than him, better footwork than him from 12 rounds. He's not going to be able to run from him at all. So that means he's going to have to stand in and fight with Bam. He can't do that. He can't hit. It's not how he fights. Bam is going to destroy him. Okay? Bam is going to stop him because you can't stand in front of Bam If you can't punch, he can't punch and he can't run from him for 12 rounds. This is a terrible fight for him. And and, and Eddie doesn't understand this. He keeps putting his boxers in there with these guys that can kill you to death, right? And Bam can kill you to death. He's going to destroy you like no other. There's a 0% chance that Sonny Edwards can win this fight. I don't really even see how he can finish the fight. He's going to get broken down. You cannot sit. This is not. He struggled with Felix Alvarado. He really did. He won the fight. I scored it for him 115, 113, 7 to 5. Okay. Uh, Felix Alvarado was past it. And he was never half as good as Bam Rodriguez to start with. Um, and he struggled. And, 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 and Sonny struggled with him big time. This is. Like a, a terrible fight stylistically. There's no path to victory for Sonny Edwards. You don't tell me he's going to sit there from long range, off the back foot, and fight Bam Rodriguez. This is how all of Eddie Hearn's British fighters get beaten down. It's not going to work. You cannot run from Bam Rodriguez for 12 rounds, no matter who you are. Specifically, if he's a better athlete, faster than you, better footwork than you, it's not going to happen. You're going to have to sit down in spots and fight him, and he can't do that at all. So he's going to get annihilated. That being said, Bam Rodriguez should no, under no circumstance go over to the U.K. And it's not because he can't get a decision, which he can't. But Bam Rodriguez is the star. Bam Rodriguez was put on the, on the co-main of, of, of Canal, not Sonny Edwards. Bam Rodriguez is the star here. Bam Rodriguez could make other fights with Julio Cesar Martinez, which is a bigger fight in the U.S. than Sonny Edwards. He could make a fight with uh, Dalekin, too. 
Eddie Hearn has all of the W uh, all of the WC belts, all the flyweight belts. And he did that for the Bam Rodriguez show. He wants Bam to run through all the belts. He knows that Sonny's gonna have a real problem with Bam. He knows that Bam's the money maker of that division. And he's gonna take Bam and carry him. Okay? So Bam has to put his foot down and say, we're doing this in Texas. If you don't want to do it in Texas, we can do it in neutral ground. Neutral ground meaning Vegas or California. Okay, but I'm not going over there. I'm the star here. I'm the draw. I'm the pound for pound guy. I'm the 2022 fighter of the year. I'm the one that Eddie Hearn get, did all this for. I'm not going over there. Bam Rodriguez is a star. Bam Rodriguez is the moneymaker. If, if there's going to be a star, an American star that comes out of the smaller weight classes, it's Bam Rodriguez. I can't think of a star from the U.S. to come out of the small weight classes in I don't know how long. Um, Michael Carbajal. Bam's that guy. So we're going to build Bam. And Bam's going to fight in the U.S. And Bam's going to f- build, build a, a fan base. We could do it in the Punch Bowl. Um, we can do it in a lot of places. We can. I'd like to do it in Texas. We can do it in San Antonio. We could do it in Dallas. We could do it in the Valley. There's so many places we can do this fight um, that that would, that would sell and would draw. If you don't want to do it in San Antonio, I, I understand. We don't need to do that. I can meet you somewhere else, but I'm not going over to the U.K. I'm not going to get Andre Durrell with Carl Frox. That's not going to happen. Not that I think it would, it's because because Bam would stop him. But Bam's the star here. Bam needs to dictate the terms. Bam's an underspoken guy. He doesn't speak a lot, right? He's a mild-mannered guy, but he don't mess with Bam, right? <laughs> he's he, he's a Texan, right? Like he's not going to run his mouth. He's not going to talk a lot of trash. But you're not going to get one over on him either. Bam needs to stay here, and Bam needs to fight Sonny Edwards in 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 Texas. If if if, if Sonny Edwards doesn't want to, I understand. I understand we can do it in Vegas and we can do it in California, but we're not going over there. And, and this idea that Sonny Edwards is somehow going to beat Bam Rodriguez and, and Eddie Harris, then he will be the number one pound for pound fighter in the UK. And then after Sonny Edwards beats Bam Rodriguez, we can ride our magical unicorn to the moon because that's got a better chance of happening than Sonny Edwards beating Bam Rodriguez. And it's going to be a painful lesson for Eddie Hearn. Like, it really is. This is going to be a painful lesson because he can't beat him, right? And it's going to be a beatdown. Like, he's going to blow him out. If you can't punch and you can't run from him, what are you going to do? Like this idea that Eddie Hearn thinks this is the amateur, where he's going to run up the back foot, he's going to throw in volume and, and outpoint him is ridiculous. It's not going to happen, Eddie. This is the, this is the pros. These are big boys. Bam's as good as they come. Um, let me know what you guys think. Leave your thoughts, comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Follow Three Box and Three Box and Blog and all forms of social media. Quick hits come. Uh, and, and you saw what happened to Bam Rodriguez, his brother, when he went over Jesse Frank, uh, Josh Franco. Uh, you saw what happened to Jesse Rodriguez, his brother, Josh Franco, when he went over to Japan. He got totally jobbed. Right now, I hope is a lot better than Sonny Edwards and 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 Bam. And, Whatever. But what I'm saying is why? Like, Bam's the star here. Don't do it. Let me know what y'all think. Leave your thoughts, comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Follow 3D Boxing, 3D Boxing Blog on all forms of social media. Quick kids can you every day, uh, 8 to 10 minutes a day, keep you up to date on the latest, greatest boxing news and rumors. It's June 14th, 2023, from Texas to the world. Thank you, and God bless. Don't miss a tweet, post, story, or video. 3D Boxing is on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Hit the subscribe button now to stay inside the ring.